As the Gladiator Priest, I did quite some coaching in Arena, and one of the biggest problems that players have is keybinds. Like, don't underestimate how fast you can play if you just learn how to play mechanically correctly. I will try to go quickly on what I do and why. The most important binds as a healer are the targeting keybinds. You want to create three macros. Target party 1, target party 2, and target self, like your name. I then use the Logitech G600 with 12 buttons on the side, and I use the first three buttons for targeting. So the first one is going to be target party 1, the second one target party 2, and the third one for self. The reason why I use mouse keybinds is because I want my keyboard hand, in my case the left hand, to be already ready on the buttons that I want to press instead of maneuvering through targeting. Let's say I want to cast a healing spell on my party 1 target, I just press one on my mouse and my left hand is already ready to press the spell. If you have a mouse with any extra buttons, I highly recommend putting your keybinds on those keys. Many also use the scroll wheel to target, but I like to adjust my camera so I keep the bind free. Don't use any modifiers when targeting as it's something that you will do many times in the game and you want things that you're pressing a lot to be fast and comfortable. It's gonna feel super tricky when you're first practicing targeting binds as you have to think extra hard on what to press while your party is dying and you will sometimes out of frustration just click them, but that's fine, the most important thing is to keep practicing until it becomes second nature. It's just like driving, your brain will learn them and your muscle memory will just do all the work and you won't have to think about them anymore. It took me a, quite some time to learn them as I've only been using them for a little bit over a year now. I will now go over my other keybinds and try to explain why I chose them. And let me start by saying that your keyboard doesn't matter. You are used to what you're used and you can get used to anything. I have a random $10 keyboard and I can press my keys just fine. First of all, I strafe with A and D and holding the right mouse button so that I can free Q and E as they are very easy and useful binds. Q and E are the easiest keybinds to press so you want good spells on them. I have Prayer of Mending and my Death Ship macro which is very important as it's something that you need to press reactively and quick. My 1, 2, 3 are my enemy targeting macros. It's something that you will press for the whole game so I put easy keybinds on them. The next row of easy keybinds are R, F, C, X, Caps Lock. Use them for spells you use the most and for reactive spells. For example my Flesh Shield is on R and my Pain Suppression is on C. Let's now talk about modifiers. I feel like many people get intimidated by them, but they make a lot of sense and they're actually pretty easy to use. Let's take shift. If you see how my hand stays when moving with WAD, you can notice that the pinky is basically resting on shift, making it a very quick and easy press. Binds like shift R, shift D, shift spacebar, as your thumb is also resting on your spacebar, so you just need to press down, are very easy binds to press. I have my greater eel on SD and my reactive fear word on SR. Shift 1, 2, 3 are also pretty easy to press. I obviously press shift with my pinky and then 1 and 2 with my middle finger and 3 with my index finger. If you have spells that you cast while moving on modifiers, the best way to do it is jumping before pressing them or moving while pressing your left and right button on your mouse at the same time so that you won't need to press the movement keys during that global. And obviously you can also bind the modifier to the extra buttons on your mouse if you have them. Now let's talk about Alt. Alt is very easy to use in combination with keys at the top of your keyboard. As your thumb slides to the bottom when pressing Alt, your other fingers are generally resting on the top keys, making Alt 1, 2, 3 very easy binds. I don't like to go too far down with Alt as then your hand starts crunching and keys get harder to press. I will never do something like Alt S. By the way, a little tip, if you want to use modifiers in combination with movement keys, something like Shift W or Control W, try to use them on spells that require casting time, so that you don't accidentally press them while moving or you might end up wasting a global and a spell. The last modifier we have is Control, and I like to use it in combination with E, D, C, R, F, as your hand slightly slides to the left when pressing Control with your pinky, and my index finger happens to be perfectly in range of the keys I just mentioned. Obviously, you can do a lot more depending on your keyboard and the size of your hands. And that's it guys, I just wanted to explain how I mechanically play the game. And if you want to play some games together or get some advice, you can follow me on Twitch. Bye bye.